Today we're gonna look at an animal that you might not believe that it used to live on Earth. Everybody knows the T-Rex, Megalodon, Titanoboa, but you most likely have never seen this thing before. This is a Mosasaurus. If you've seen the movie Jurassic World, this thing is in that movie. The thing that eats the shark is a Mosasaurus. This thing lived in the dinosaur ages, and at the same time as the dinosaurs, around 66 million years ago, they went extinct. For the first time, they found the skull of this thing in Maastricht, Netherlands, in a chalk quarry. At first, they thought it was a whale or a crocodile. Then a hundred years later, they found out that this thing is a giant lizard, and it lived in the ocean. This thing was not small at all. It had a length of 18 meters. Weird looking teeth that each one was like a sword. And it could open its jaw just like a lizard. Just imagine this thing and imagine it opening its mouth like a lizard. You guys already know the Megalodon, the king of the sharks that lived in warm waters. But this thing lived in all types of waters because the fossils were found everywhere on Earth, even Antarctica. Megalodon with that size thought it was the king of the oceans, but if it saw this thing, it had to bow down. Why? Because the Mosasaurus would easily defeat the Megalodon. Megalodon is lucky that it didn't live at the same time as this thing. Scientists believe if the Mosasaurus didn't go extinct, the Megalodon wouldn't exist either because this wouldn't allow it. Its main food source were sharks. If it stayed, it wouldn't allow sharks to get bigger and bigger and turn into the Megalodon. Sharks are scary creatures and they're not afraid of anything. It has lived on Earth for 450 million years, and you can say that it hasn't changed much. You can say sharks have seen all of history, because it has seen almost all the animals that have gone extinct. So we realized sharks aren't afraid of anything, except the Mosasaurus. When a shark confronted one of these, it would run like a little rat. Sharks should have gone extinct because of the Mosasaurs, but when you look at the speed of them, they can go as fast as 50 kilometers an hour. But sharks were a little bit faster, meaning around 52 kilometers an hour. It would barely escape. Most animals, to make themselves better, they go through evolution, and this is a natural thing. An animal that didn't go through evolution as much as the other ones and didn't change much are sharks. Why through all these years, this creature didn't change at all? An idea suggests that it didn't need to change, because the Mosasaurus was a short period of time, and except that, it didn't have any enemies. Mosasaurus had a short life on Earth, but compared to Earth's life, they only lived in the oceans for 16 million years. Then they went extinct and that didn't give them much time to make the sharks go extinct or go through evolution and turn into something better. If you guys remember in our previous video, we said the Komodo dragon is the biggest lizard in the world. But we didn't say it was the biggest lizard in the history of the world because the largest lizard in the history of Earth is the Mosasaurus. Mosasaurus was a lizard that lived in the oceans, but to breathe, it had to come up like a whale. They say around the time the Mosasaurus lived in the oceans, there was no shortage of food, meaning any type of food they wanted, they could have it. One day it would eat sharks, one day turtles, one day whales, and sometimes when they would get bored, 
the bigger Mosasaurus would eat the smaller ones. You could kind of say that they helped their own extinctions by doing this. The way Mosasaurus hunt their prey was different from sharks. The sharks would bite and tear the prey apart and go do a lap around. But Mosasaurus had such a strong jaw that anything it grabbed with its jaw, it would not let go. There was no creature that could escape this teeth and jaw power. Scientists believe that 150 million years ago, lizards entered the water. The only times the only predator in the waters were sharks. And if there was no sharks in sight, that means there was no threat. When the lizards entered the waters, they went through evolution and got bigger and bigger. And it took around 70 million years for the lizard to turn into the Mosasaurus. And that made it become the king of the oceans. But it didn't realize that sharks could swim two kilometers faster than them. Scientists believe that predators should be in waters and on land. If they're not there, it messes up the ecosystem. In the oceans, if there are no creatures like sharks or orcas, evolution stops in other fishes. And after a while, the sea creatures will turn into the same thing. And that is because there is no danger. And this is not good for the ecosystem. It's kind of unlucky that the Mosasaurus left so early. Because if it was still in the oceans, the animals that lived around it would be something else now. Because this thing would make everything in the oceans turn into something else. And most importantly, the sharks. If this thing was still around, sharks would be faster and bigger and stronger. The evolution for sharks would go in this direction. So one way, it had to get faster so they could run away from the Mosasaurus or they would get stronger so they would be more powerful so they can put up a fight. But this same asteroid that wiped out Earth 66 million years ago also made the Mosasaurus go extinct. But it also wiped out more than three-fourths of the Earth's population. Some people believe that evolution is like two, three hundred, one thousand, two thousand years time. In those times, there could be small changes, but huge changes take a lot of time. Like for example, the lizard that entered the water, it took it 70 million years for it to turn into a Mosasaurus. We don't really need it, but if we needed it, we would be tall as the Empire State Building. But we don't really need this height, so it's not gonna happen. But be sure that our brains in this time will go through evolution and get better.